Ditch the expensive store-bought scent boosters. Want fresh, fragrant laundry without the hefty price tag? Of course you do. Store-bought scent boosters can be expensive, and who needs that? It's time to unlock the power of DIY and create your own laundry scent booster using simple, budget-friendly ingredients. Trust me, this easy swap will have your clothes smelling divine, and your wallet will thank you. If you love tips like these, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to The Big Sweep for more amazing hacks. Simple ingredients for a heavenly scent. You only need two key ingredients to create your own magic laundry potion, baking soda, and essential oils. You can substitute the baking soda for Epsom salts if you prefer. Baking soda, a natural deodorizer, neutralizes odors, leaving your clothes smelling clean and fresh. Essential oils, on the other hand, are the stars of the show, infusing your laundry with delightful scents that linger long after the dryer stops. Creating your signature laundry scent. A step-by-step -step guide. Imagine the fresh, invigorating aroma of your favorite essential oils infusing your laundry making every wash a delightful experience. Today, we're going to show you how to create your very own laundry scent booster from scratch. Ready to unleash your inner mixologist? This project is perfect for anyone who loves a personalized touch and enjoys experimenting with different scents. Plus, it's incredibly easy and fun. This simple three-step process will have you whipping up your own laundry scent booster in no time. Let's get started. One, grab your supplies. You'll need a jar with a lid, a mason jar works great, baking soda, and your favorite essential oils. The jar will serve as the container for your mixture, and the lid will help keep it fresh. Essential oils are the key to creating a unique and pleasant scent. Choose oils that you love, whether it's lavender for a calming effect, lemon for a fresh and clean smell, or eucalyptus for a refreshing aroma. 2. Combine the ingredients. Fill your jar with 2 cups of baking soda. Baking soda is a natural deodorizer and will help to absorb and neutralize odors in your laundry. Add 20 to 30 drops of your chosen essential oil or blend of oils. This is where you can get creative. Mix and match different oils to create a scent that's uniquely yours. Start with fewer drops, you can always add more later. It's easier to add more oil than to take it out, so go slow and test the scent as you go. 3. Mix it up. Close the jar tightly and give it a good shake to distribute the essential oils evenly throughout the baking soda. Make sure the lid is secure to avoid any spills. And there you have it. Your DIY laundry scent booster is ready to work its magic. Simply add a tablespoon or two to your laundry during the wash cycle and enjoy the fresh, personalized scent. Not only will your clothes smell amazing, but you'll also have the satisfaction of knowing you made it yourself. Happy washing. Essential Oils 101. Picking your perfect aroma. Choosing the right essential oils is key to creating a scent you'll love. Here are a few ideas to get you started. For a calming and relaxing scent, lavender is always a classic choice. For a refreshing and invigorating aroma, try citrus oils like lemon, orange, or grapefruit. For a clean and crisp scent, peppermint or eucalyptus will do the trick. Feel free to experiment with different essential oil combinations to create your own unique signature scent. Laundry day just got better. Using your DIY scent booster is as easy as can be. First, simply sprinkle one to two tablespoons of your homemade scent booster into the washing machine drum along with your regular detergent. Then, run your washing machine cycle as you normally would. And now, enjoy the delightful fragrance as your clothes emerge from the wash smelling fresh and amazing. A long-lasting freshness is just a few steps away. Imagine opening your closet and being greeted by the delightful scent of freshly laundered clothes. It's a small pleasure that can make a big difference in your day. Here are a few extra tips to keep your clothes smelling fresh and clean. These simple steps can help you maintain that just washed scent for longer, ensuring your wardrobe always feels inviting. Don't overstuff your washing machine. Overloading can prevent clothes from getting properly clean and rinsed, leading to lingering odors. When the machine is too full, water and detergent can't circulate effectively, which means dirt and sweat might not be fully washed away. Choose the right detergent. Opt for one that's formulated for your laundry needs, whether it's for sensitive skin, stain removal, or color protection. A good detergent can make a significant difference in how your clothes smell after washing. Look for detergents with added fabric softeners or those that are specifically designed to combat odors. Air dry your clothes whenever possible. The sun's natural ultraviolet rays help to eliminate odors and leave your clothes smelling fresh. Plus, air drying can be gentler on fabrics, helping them last longer. 
If you don't have outdoor space, consider using a drying rack near an open window. And finally, store your clothes properly. A well-organized closet or drawer can make a big difference in maintaining freshness. Make sure they are completely dry before storing them in drawers or closets to prevent musty smells. Damp clothes can quickly develop mold and mildew, which not only smells bad, but can also damage the fabric. Consider using scented sachets or cedar blocks in your storage areas to add an extra layer of freshness. With these tips, you can enjoy the pleasant aroma of clean clothes every day. Make sure to give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to The Big Sweep for more great laundry tips. What's your favorite laundry scent? Leave a comment below and share your thoughts with us. The benefits of a DIY scent booster are plentiful. Making your own laundry scent booster is not only easy and affordable, but it also comes with a whole host of benefits. It's cost-effective. You'll save money compared to buying expensive store-bought scent boosters. It's customizable. You can create your own unique scents by experimenting with different essential oil blends. It's natural and gentle. Using natural ingredients like baking soda and essential oils is a gentler alternative to harsh chemicals often found in commercial products. And finally, it's environmentally friendly. DIY scent boosters reduce packaging waste and minimize your environmental impact. Troubleshooting your DIY scent booster. If you find that your homemade scent booster isn't delivering the desired fragrance, there are a few things you can try. Sometimes the scent might not be as strong as you hoped, or it might fade too quickly. Don't worry, these issues are common and can be easily fixed with a few adjustments. First, increase the amount of essential oil. Essential oils are the key ingredient in your scent booster, and their concentration directly affects the strength of the fragrance. Gradually add more essential oil drops to your mixture until you achieve your desired scent strength. Start with a few extra drops and mix thoroughly. Test the scent by taking a small amount and smelling it. If it's still not strong enough, add a few more drops and repeat the process. Next, use high-quality essential oils. The quality of the essential oils you use can make a significant difference in the final product. Not all essential oils are created equal. Some may be diluted or contain synthetic additives that weaken their potency. Investing in high-quality oils will ensure a more potent and long-lasting fragrance. Look for oils that are 100% pure and sourced from reputable suppliers. Check reviews and do a bit of research to find the best options available. Finally, store your scent booster properly. Proper storage is crucial to maintaining the effectiveness of your DIY scent booster. Keep your DIY scent booster in an airtight container in a cool, dark place to preserve the fragrance and prevent the essential oils from evaporating. Exposure to light, heat, and air can degrade the oils and reduce their effectiveness. By following these tips, you can ensure that your homemade scent booster remains fresh and fragrant for a longer period. Exploring different essential oil combinations. Once you've mastered the basic recipe, don't be afraid to get creative and experiment with different essential oil combinations to create your own signature scents. Here are a few ideas to inspire you. For a romantic and floral aroma, combine lavender, rose geranium, and ylang ylang essential oils. For a warm and cozy scent, try blending cinnamon, clove, and orange essential oils. For a fresh and uplifting fragrance, mix peppermint, eucalyptus, and lemon essential oils. A greener approach to laundry. Making your own laundry scent booster is a simple yet effective way to reduce your environmental impact. By using natural ingredients and minimizing packaging waste, you're making a conscious choice towards a greener lifestyle. Plus, you'll be saving money and enjoying the satisfaction of creating something with your own two hands. Embrace the joy of DIY. Creating your own laundry scent booster is a fun and rewarding experience. Not only will you save money and reduce your environmental impact, but you'll also enjoy the satisfaction of knowing exactly what's in your laundry products. So gather your ingredients, unleash your creativity, and enjoy the delightful fragrance of your homemade laundry scent booster. Hit that subscribe button, give us a thumbs up, and share this video with your friends. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next episode.